Hey guys, my name is Matimio, and today I'm here to bring you some free-for-all gameplay on Array. And I'm going to be playing as a sniper class, and hopefully giving you guys some fun footage that you guys will really enjoy. Uh, so, the main reason why I actually wanted to make this video was to kind of give you guys an update on my NGT Games videos. Uh, I am a next-gen tactics director, so I make a lot of videos for them, so I am not able to make... Uh, as many videos for my channel, I still pump out as many as I can, uh, but I'm going to give you guys a link to those videos. Uh, the first video is where I have a 35-3 and 3 game um, on Hanoi, and I'm playing some team deathmatch, and in that video I'm explaining how to use and abuse your radar to your advantage, and how you can also manipulate your enemy's radar uh, to get the drop on them. So I hope you guys enjoy that. If you guys want to see that, I will leave a link uh, later in the video. Or maybe right here, I haven't decided yet, and also in the description. Uh, the next video is a domination game where I go 49-4 and four on the firing range. And um, that was also a very fun a fun game, and I'll leave also a link for that down below, like I said. Uh, so if you guys are actually wondering what my setup is, I am using Ghost, uh, Ghost Pro, Scout Pro, and Hacker. I'm not, I actually haven't gotten Hacker uh, Pro yet, but I'm working on it. And as for my tactical, I am using Claymore, as you guys can see right there. Uh, get a nice nice little knife with the Claymore out. And the weapon I am using is the L96A1. At least I believe that's that's what it is. And with the extended mags. And the reason why I'm using extended mags is because I find that uh, if you don't have it, you're just reloading too frequently, and I just hate reloading with a sniper rifle. It takes forever, and I hate just, yeah, reloading. Uh, I wouldn't really recommend if you w actually want to be successful in this game as a sniper. I definitely would not use anything other than this weapon. Uh, the other ones, you're going to get hit marker after hit marker, and it is by far the most frustrating thing ever. Uh, I, I tr I've tried every single one out, and this is by far uh, the this this weapon is by far the the best one, at least in my opinion, for sniping, and I've had the most success with it. Uh, if you go with the other ones, you're definitely going to want to have Scout Pro because you're going to have so many hit markers and you're really going to want to have to switch to your pistol immediately once you actually get the hit and try to take them out as quickly as possible. Uh, it's pretty frustrating. Even with this weapon, I have to do that uh, quite frequently, especially if the enemy has uh, Last Stand or whatever it's called in this game. Or final, I don't even know. And so, But yeah, it's, it's definitely a very frustrating... Uh, thing to happen when you get a hit marker and they're like four feet away from you and I find that using this weapon that doesn't happen as often but definitely still happens. Uh, as for my secondary I can't actually remember what I'm using I think I'm just using the final one that you have to unlock after all the pistols that you buy and with it I'm using the attachment that makes the weapon automatic. Uh, for some reason I have a really hard time with the just clicking it. I, maybe it's my mouse but I find that if I don't have the uh, the automatic uh, attachment. I just have a hard time. And as for more my uh, kill streaks, I believe I'm using Spy Plane, the Blackbird, and the Attack Dogs. Uh, there's definitely been some games where I've gotten the Attack Dogs as sniping, and actually got one on this game, and or not this game, but this map. And I thought I was gonna win. I was like, wow, this is awesome. This is gonna be a sweet free for all. I can put this on YouTube, and uh, sure enough. The attack dogs got one kill total, and it was pretty, pretty depressing. I, I, it was, it was, it was a really good game until then, and then I just, it just went downhill from there. I was just like, wow, I don't even, I don't even care anymore. They're supposed to give me all of my kills, and you got me nothing. Uh, so if you're going to be using attack dogs on this map, I would, I would kind of recommend. And wow, that was strange. That definitely looked like I had a, got a kill on him. Uh, but yeah, I definitely would not recommend attack dogs on this, on this map. It's, it, the map is too big. And the chopper gunner and the gunship, at least in my opinion, are a are a better choice. Now, if you're actually going to want to try out this setup, I, I recommend it. It's a lot of fun, but be careful. You're going to get really frustrated uh, quite frequently. Uh, I must say that this is probably one of the most frustrating class setups I've ever actually tried in a Call of Duty game. I've, I've played a lot of sniper sniper classes in Battlefield Bad Company 2. I used to play this um, with the sniper in Modern Warfare 2 and in Call of Duty 4. So I have a pretty good background with uh, sniper rifles, but like I actually use one in real life. No. Uh, wow, that was another shot that I thought should hit. Uh, but yeah, I, I feel like I'm, I'm pretty good with this kind of setup, but I must say that this is by far the hardest game to snipe in. 
and uh, I'm still learning. I'm still going through a learning process. And so, if you actually want to try, it, if you're trying to, if you want to try it out, uh, like I said, it's going to be frustrating, but it definitely provides some really fun and exciting gameplay when you actually uh, get into a groove and start taking multiple multiple people out really quickly. Uh, but that actually leads to a question that I want to ask you guys, and that is, do you want to see some more sniper footage from me? I plan on making more sniper footage regardless in the future, but if you guys really want me to buckle down and really try to master uh, this class setup, I will do my best to do that and provide even more footage. Uh, but let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and leaving a comment below. That's, that's That would be a very good indication that you guys want to see more from me. Uh, but if not, just let me know as well if you guys want me to stick with the normal... That was a cool That was a cool kill. If you guys just want me to stick with the normal killing with, you know, the assault rifles and the submachine sub guns, I am more than happy to do, to do that as well. Uh, but yeah, guys, this about wraps up the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And like I mentioned earlier, I will leave a link in the description to the other two videos that I mentioned. Uh, but also, if you guys want to see more sniper footage from me, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment. Uh, but yeah, guys, have a good one and take it easy.